everyone, my name is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Dreams Come True, Joseph's Race to Power, Genesis chapter 39 to chapter 45. Joseph served Potiphar well. Potiphar's wife wanted Joseph to sin against God. Joseph rushed, so she lied about him. Potiphar believed her. Joseph was thrown into prison. Oh, that's so bad. Joseph actually part part said that you can do everything what someone tells you but not about my wife and one time wife has called Joseph and Joseph knew that he was not allowed so he said, I can't do what you're saying about you. So wife was so angry, so he lied to part part. He will be... In prison, Joseph met two of Paro's servant. They each had a dream, and God showed Joseph their meanings. Joseph's explanation came true. The cupbearer was real, realized, and the baker was hanged. So. He have put it in the prison. And he met two prisoners. One was the baker of the part part and one was the cup bear of the part part. So Joseph and Dale had the dreams and he has sold the dreams from and got told and the dream came true <laughs> two years later Paro had two troubling dreams the cupbearer remembered what Joseph had done for him and told the Paro. So Paro sent to, for Joseph and told him his dreams. So Paro had two troubling dreams. And Cupbear was with Joseph and he remembered him. So he told to the told to Paro that Joseph can tell your meanings, dreams meaning. I that is right thank thankful well because you have remembered Joseph, right? God showed Joseph the meanings of Paro's dreams. For seven years, a lot of food will grow, said Joseph. 
See, so store up food because seven years of famine will follow. God is always with Joseph, and because of God's help, Joseph has solved the king's dream and the two prisoners, right? Question. God helped Joseph understand the meaning of the dreams. True. If there was no, if if there was, God didn't help. He couldn't stall the meaning of the dream. Was impressed by Joseph's wisdom, so he put Joseph in charge of storing up all the food apart from Paro. No one in Egypt was powerful than Joseph. So Paro was so impressed by Joseph. Wisdom. So jo Paro put Joseph in charge of the storing up all the food. So he will tell how much food we have to like store. And in Egypt, no one was powerful than Joseph, even the king and Paro. I think they're storing there. Okay. I think first time it was he looking heavy. And he's taking that. Joseph's brother went to Egypt to buy food. They bowed before Joseph, but did not recognize him. When he saw that they had changed, he told them who he was. So actually, before this, like Joseph was telling the brother was the spy. And in the Benjamins, in the Benjamins, what I say, bag, he put as the silver cup. So he was saying that someone has stole, and that Benjamin should work for him, but the brother. Now was brother was changed. Brothers were changed. So he said like no I will be instead. No, I will be the slave instead Benjamin. So he knew brother was changed. So he told that he is there he is Joseph. Question that Paro put Joseph in charge of number three the half food. Okay, when they knew that Joseph the brother were terrified. You mean to harm me, Joseph said but God used that for good, bringing all of my family family to Egypt. 
we will have plenty to eat. So, so, first time their brother were terrified because like Joseph can kill them or like, put them, them in the prison because he is very high position now and they have done wrong to his their brothers so they're afraid, afraid but joseph forgive his brothers we should forgive forgive many people right many times Question Joseph's brother met me me to harm him but got broke good out of it. True Yes Today I read the Bible story did you enjoy and next time I'll read another story. See you next time. Bye